This is how you can use Claude 3.5 Sonnet to generate SEO content by just entering a URL. Add this incredibly powerful SEO app and in just a few clicks, you'll be outranking your competitors and dominating the first page of Google for your niche. It's 100% free and only takes a click to get started. This is the ultimate Claude hack. Get amazing results the easy way. If you're new to the channel, Welcome, subscribers to the channel have a passion for SEO and staying ahead of the curve. So the first thing we need to do to supercharge Claude is add this extension. Now the way we do it is head to this page here. I'll leave a link in the description. It's the ambitious hub. If we scroll down a bit, this is what we need here. So we just click on this and you can add the Claude SEO Assistant Chrome extension. If you've installed it correctly, you should see a little icon up in the in the top bar of your browser and you make sure you pin it to the browser. If you don't, it won't have access to the page and it won't work. So if you've done it correctly, you'll see these three extra buttons here, SEO strategy, SEO blog, and, and the out rank one. What we're going to do is we're going to use this outrank tool. What it asks is to enter the URL to outrank and select the tone. So first we need to find a reference article or a competitor's article that we want to improve upon. So I've just gone over to this website here, mangojuice.app, and there's a whole heap of blog articles on here. And I've selected this one here. Now this, this article's ranking, but it's on the second page of Google. What I'm going to do is improve this article and republish it as a new article. So if we just do a search, in Google, we can see where it is. I've just put in here the ultimate guide to the best SEO tools. And if we scroll down a bit, here it is here. It's actually on the second page. So now all we need to do is copy the URL, go back to Claude, click on the outrank, paste the URL in. I'm gonna go for a casual tone, press submit, and let Claude do its thing. So this is the article that Claude using this extension has rewritten. And you'll notice down the bottom, it's also giving the meta title, the meta description. It's also outlining internal link opportunities and also external sources. Now, if you have a look in the article, you'll see that it's also placed links within the article. If we just copy it, we can take it over to a Word doc. So here's the article. It's about 1100 words. You can see it's written in markdown format. And throughout the article, you can also see the links. Here's one. There are others and down the bottom, you get the full listing of them as well for your external resources, which you can put at the bottom of your article. And in fact, if I go over to the original article and I scroll down to the bottom, I think we see some here as well. Useful links. Now it's time to publish this article. When I've done that, I'm actually going to index it and we're going to see where we can get it ranked within the next 48 to 72 hours. Here is the article that Claude Outrank generated. I have formatted it a little bit and I have double checked that the links work. All I have to do now is go up and copy the URL and I'm just going to go across to the Google Search Console. And if you don't know how to do this, it's pretty easy. We want to get this page indexed fast. So go over to the GSC, click on URL inspection. I'm just going to paste this brand new URL in and it's going to go and retrieve this information. And it says it's not indexed. No surprise. It was only generated about five minutes ago. So we're going to request the indexing. All right, so it's requested. I'm going to check back here in maybe 48, 72 hours. We'll see where it's at and see if we get starting to get impressions. Okay, so we forced the indexing about 72 hours ago. So this is the published article. I'm just going to take a copy of the URL. I'm going to head back over to Google Search Console. And you can see now, if you go back in the video a bit, you'll see the index pages count was 96. Now it's 97. And if I go to the URL inspection, I can paste the URL in. And we can see that, in fact, the URL is on Google and it is indexed. So now if we go and do a Google search, we can just check to see that um, it's appearing and then we can see where it's actually appearing in search results. So if I go over to Google and I add in the post title and I put it in quotation marks, I can just check that it actually is appearing. So you can see that it appears twice. The first one is the actual post and the second one is because it's on the very first page as a featured, a featured article. And then if we go over to Google and we do the search, the ultimate guide to SEO tools for digital marketing, you can see that the post is right here in position number two, and it was indexed within three days 
it's getting impressions and it's getting clicks. If you like the Outrank tool, you're probably going to try the SEO strategy tool. And I want to give you a quick tip on how to use it. There's been a lot of discussion about a problem copying and pasting the output over to Google Sheet. First, just click on SEO strategy. We'll enter in a keyword. I'll keep it nice and simple. I'll just use the one and I'll press submit. Okay, so here's our content strategy plan. If you want to keep it in Claude, you can. But if you want to put it on a Google Sheet or Excel, just highlight all the input. Control C if you're on Windows. And that's it. We are now in Google Sheets. For some reason, many people have commented that it's impossible to actually get it to format correctly. And I'll show you why that is happening. If you go back to the content plan, I suspect what's happening. People are pressing copy here, which makes total sense. And then when they go and paste it, they get a total mess. Alrighty, so I hope you got some value from this video. If you did, consider liking and subscribing. If you haven't checked out the first two videos I did on the Claude SEO extension, I'll put them here. Check them out. Catch you in the next one.